Good evening. Thanks for joining us for Nightcast. I'm Lee Peck. A Longville man is in custody tonight after authorities say he shot and killed his wife in their Longville home earlier today, but not before fleeing the scene. KPLC's Jaron Jordan has been working this story and has the very latest developments. Yeah, Lee, well, the latest information, as you mentioned, is that the shooter, 61-year-old Randall Langley, has been found. He's being tended to at the hospital here behind me, Krista St. Patrick's in Lake Charles, after sustaining injuries from a single vehicle accident in Maryville earlier today while fleeing that crime scene. Now, all of this serves as a conclusion to almost a day-long search by authorities and a day of mourning and grief for a family. Borgard Parish Sheriff's officials say 61-year-old Randall Langley of Longville shot and killed his wife, 44-year-old Sherry Lynn, in their Longville home Sunday afternoon. Chief Deputy Joe Toller says just before 1.30, the couple's daughter called 911, alerting them of the shooting. When deputies arrived, Sherry Langley, an employee at South Borgard Upper Elementary School, had died, and Randall Langley, her husband, was nowhere to be found. A multi-parish, multi-agency search effort started. Hours later, late Sunday night, Toller says Langley was involved in a single vehicle accident in Maryville, where Maryville police found his truck engulfed in flames. He was airlifted to Christus St. Patrick's Hospital in Lake Charles, where city police identified him as the Longville homicide suspect. As of late Sunday night, Borgard Parish officials were en route to Lake Charles with an arrest warrant for Langley. Now, the extent of Langley's injuries are unknown at this time. We do believe he's still in the hospital. There are Borgard Parish Sheriff's vehicles outside of the emergency room just behind me, and we do know that they have that signed arrest warrant from a Borgard Parish judge. Now, Chief Deputy Toller says there is no motive yet in this shooting. I was able to talk with uh, Borgard Parish Sheriff Ricky Moses earlier today, who said that early reports indicate that this was obviously a domestic incident. At your service live outside of Christus St. Patrick's Hospital in Lake Charles, Jaron Jordan, KPLC 7 News.